Yo, what's going on guys? I'm gonna get straight up on this commentary right here. I'm gonna make this one quick. Got some capture flag on rundown. Uh from my house bling uh, sleight of hand. Whoa. I just messed that up. I just said look, I don't know if you heard that, but I was just like FAMAS bling sleight of hand. How do you have bling and sleight of hand? Actually, if you think about it, that would be a pretty cool perk. A perk to have two perks. And maybe it like takes away something else, like your equipment or something. But you get two perks, so it balances it out. Yeah, I'm, I, I need to be making these games, man. I come up with some pretty good ideas sometimes. I've always come up with ideas that I thought would be cool. I mean, they would have to try it first, because it could, it could go completely bad, like a uh, one-man army. Danger close, noob tubes, you know about that. <laughs> you know, because stuff does go wrong. Might think it's a good idea at first, but turns out not to be super great. But I would like to have a perk where you could have two perks, but maybe it takes away both your secondary and your equipment. Maybe uh, having that perk would help you for rushing or something. You know, have marathon, lightweight, ninja, and sleight of hand. Like that would that would really be a killer. But the downside is, may like you wouldn't be able to use your semtex or your uh, stun grenades. I almost said flash, but who uses flash grenades? I mean, if you do, I'm not hating on you. It's just, uh, I think most people use stuns because you throw them faster. But, uh, and I forgot what I was talking about. Actually, I think I'm still on topic. Yeah, but it would take away your stun grenades or flash grenades, your semtex, any equipment, and your secondary. So you'd kind of have no ammo, um, unless, well, you could do that combo. You could do Marathon, Lightweight, Sleight of Hand, and Scavenger, maybe, or something. I don't know, that would be kind of cool. Uh, just a thought. You guys might agree with me, might not, but let me know what your ideas are. If you have any cool perk ideas to sub out for those bad ones, like One Man Army, Danger Close, uh... Last Stand, Commando. So what would you sub out for those perks? I would definitely sub out... Sub out... Any of those for the one I just said. Or maybe you could do some... I think in Black Ops they have... Uh, I can't remember all the names for them, but they have one where you're not affected by stun grenades. Which I'll be super happy with. I might use that a lot. Um, but again... When when uh, Modern Warfare 2 came out, I think I said I was going to use, like, bling, like, all the time. Like, that would be, like, the only thing I used, because I always wanted two attachments. But that wasn't really the perk that I thought would be the most useful, because I didn't know the order of the perks. And I found out Sleight of Hand was a first perk instead of a second, like in COD 4. And it turned out pretty good. But... Let me talk about this gameplay real quick. Uh, if you can see on the scoreboard and during this host migration, they have a clan of people. And if you notice, one of them just left. And this is this is pretty much the best way to win Capture the Flag. Uh, you'll see in a minute. Uh, so you can see that our score is four to nothing. We're pretty much owning them. I'm um, getting kills. You know, our whole team is pretty much doing what they're supposed to do. And one guy, and and without a question, this is the best way to win a game. You own them. You rape them so hard that they just, they quit. That is the best way to win a game. If you can, if you can do good enough to make their whole team back out, do it, man. Just own them. So just run them flags and make them quit, and there you go. Easy win. Hope you guys enjoyed this one, and I'll see you guys next time. Have a good day.